For this installation, we brought together two works by the artist Katie Patterson, an artist book titled A Place That Exists Only in Moonlight, and an installation titled Candle from Earth into a Black Hole, which is a scented candle that burns over 12 hours to create a journey through space via scent. We decided to install this work over the course of a few months, but activating the candle over a number of evenings, where we brought together collaborators from across our community and campus. Katie Patterson is really interested in collaborating across disciplines. She often works with researchers and scientists. In fact, for the work Candle, she worked with researchers at NASA to create some of the scents. Each of those scents correspond to sites across the universe. Her work is really interested in thinking about our place on Earth and our relationship to time and to the universe and the cosmos more broadly. Her other work, A Place That Exists Only in Moonlight, she has these kind of conceptual ideas, which she calls artworks to exist only in the imagination. We're really interested in thinking about how the museum can be a site that brings us beyond only the visual. So we worked with musicians, singers, dancers, and writers and poets to create these activations during these evenings while the candle was burning to bring together the scent of Katie Patterson's work alongside these other senses. We had poets and writers share poems are in original texts that were inspired by the universe and our place in it and this included the work of a graduate student who wrote their own texts responding to his texts in her artist's book. The biggest rule breaking makes the world a body. Your wormholes a carrion quality. Your words no word. We also had other musicians. An original composition developed by one of the students that again responded to Patterson's work. We also had dancers who created these dances that interpreted some of Patterson's descriptions of these different scents as well. We were really interested in also the work unfolding over time, just like she's thinking about this sort of extended experience of time. We wanted to draw out the experience for visitors in bringing the candle into life and to also think collaboratively as she does in how the museum can be a site for engaging the whole body and bringing the visual, the sonic, the tactile, the physical, and the emotional all together in one space. <laughs>